Hello everyone, welcome back to the Villa of Vibes. Today I'll be making a Kirby rug. And make sure you stay till the end of the video because I may or may not be doing a giveaway with this. With that being said, I hope you guys enjoy the video. So I don't have the right color of pink, so let's go to the yarn store. Alright, so right now I'm on my way to get some yarn. The yarn store is probably like 10-15 minutes away from me, so it's not that far. Quick little drive. So today I'm gonna need some like pink yarn, light pink, and then some like dark pink, and maybe like a purple or something. This is the Joann's. Pretty big, you know, just remodeled. All right, so this is what I got right here. This one, and a few of these, and then this one. The amount of stuff they have in the store is actually crazy. With that being said, let's go back home and get back to work. So now that the black border and the pink is done, we're gonna do some shading. I'm gonna do this part next right here. This one, this one, this one, that one. Not that one actually. With this pink right here. It's a little bit darker, so it'll be like a nice little shading color right here. Thank you. 
tufting process, but this rug is only halfway done. This is the front side right here. So I say it's only halfway done because we have to glue the back and then let it dry for like 12 hours max. And then after it's fully dried, we cut it out and then add the backing onto it. And then the final step, we have to trim this whole rug. And the trimming process honestly probably takes just as long as the tufting process, maybe a little bit less. So yeah, that's why I say it's only halfway done. Quick interruption right here, if you made it this far into the video and you didn't just skip to the end, comment Werby right here and you'll get two extra entries into the giveaway. But shh, don't tell anyone, don't tell anyone. So I waited overnight for this to dry and it's finally dry, so let's cut it out. As you can see, when it gets dry, it's like it's like a little hard and like very tacky, so it's like sticky, which is good. That's what we need. All right, so after I fully hot glued the edges, now I'm gonna go around and like trim a little bit more just to get all the, you know, excess fabric sticking out.
Thank you all for watching. Like I said at the beginning of the video, I'm gonna do a giveaway with this rug. The rules are simple. All you have to do is like this video, make sure you're subscribed, and leave a comment below why you deserve or want this rug. And make sure you follow all the rules because I'll know if you don't. And I'll be picking the winner in my next YouTube video, so stay tuned for that. And yeah, that's about it. I hope you guys love this Kirby rug as much as I do. I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.